I'm JD. I'm a part-time woodworker and a novice guitar player. Up until now, I've only built furniture and cabinetry. I've never built a guitar before. In this series, you can follow along with me through all my successes and problems as I attempt to build an electric guitar from scratch. You'll see every step as I turn these four boards into this. All right, there it is. I'm coloring it done. So there's still things that could be done to this. I could go back and clean up a couple of the small blemishes that are still here in the finish. There are a couple fret ends that are not as smooth as they could be. They're not gonna cut me or anything. I just feel that I've made some of them nice and some of them up here are not quite as nice. Um, I did uh, learn how to polish the frets up really nice, but I didn't bother polishing them all. It's just gonna get dirty anyway. Um, I'm gonna color it done. Uh, this is a guitar that is built for me to just enjoy and play. And so this is all I need right now. I'm really happy with the way this came out. Um, it's, a, it's a beautiful guitar, at least to my eye it is. Uh, I love the shape of it. I love the colors. Um, I didn't expect the top to come out nearly this nice. When I started the project, I was expecting to actually paint this thing. Uh, but um, I decided to go ahead and do the four-piece maple top, which is an unconventional decision. But uh, I think it came out really nice. The burst came out exactly as I hoped for. The edges are nice and dark. Um, the color, I think, is just amazing. I kind of lucked out with it. Um, some of the browns still come through from the, uh, the wood color, as well as the lighter blues in the center, the darker blue on the outside. Um, just completely happy with everything. Couldn't be more, more satisfied with this project. This was a long project, uh, but it was a very rewarding project. It was difficult, um, but actually more attainable than I thought it would be. Um, I figured that with my skills, I would be able to put together a guitar that plays. Uh, I thought it would be nearly impossible for me to put together a guitar that had a neck that really felt good to play, as well as getting all the action and set up and uh, everything dialed into the point where it's a good playing guitar. I was really uh, surprised at how attainable this project is. Um, this guitar is, is a very, very good playing guitar. Uh, I'm not a tech. Uh, I, I, I'm not going to show you how I set up the guitar, but I took a lot of time to, uh, to play around with it and get it all set up. Um, and once I got all the, the different parameters dialed in and, and got the buzz out and, and, and brought the action to where I like it and everything, it this just turned into a really, really good playing guitar. And the sound of this guitar is, is everything I could hope for. Um, these P90s, um, these are Seymour Duncan P90 uh, vintage, uh, these, these things rock. When, when I have this thing cranked up, uh, it, the sound is just raucous. It really is. Uh, definitely, I highly recommend these. Thank you. 
hope everybody takes this as a what happened video and not a how-to video. Uh, I made a lot of mistakes. Uh, I learned a lot in this process and if I went to go back and do it all again, uh, I would do a lot of things uh, very different than the way I did it the first time. Um, but it just goes to show you that there's a lot of different ways to do the same thing and uh, it's up to the maker to uh, build however uh, the maker is able to with whatever tools they have and whatever skills they have with those tools and confidence they have with those tools. And a special thanks to all the YouTubers out there that's putting up so much great content. Uh, I watched so many videos uh, prior to making this guitar. Uh, there's just no way I can name everybody. I wish I could. Uh, but there's so, so much great knowledge out there that lets uh, people like me achieve results like this. Uh, in some ways, that's why I did this video series. That's to um, kind of add to the body of knowledge that's out there. Um, not as, as how something should be done, but as how something was done or how something can be done. So I hope it's helpful. I hope it was somewhat entertaining. But um, to all the YouTubers, thank you so much.